next guest pulled off the biggest upset in the Olympic Games when he defeated the legendary Russian wrestler Alexander Karelin. You see that guy? Wasn't he oh, an yeah. evil looking guy? Yeah, oh, well, he's, he's a Russian. Russian. Oh, there you go. Yeah. <laughs> Take a look at his winning moment right here. Gardner has a heart the size of that 56 inch chest. Well, time is running down. There's only two seconds to go. That's it! Oh, my! Do you believe in miracles again? Roland Gardner has Welcome gold medalist, Ruben Gardner, ladies and gentlemen. Look at that show. You know, he's not in L.A. one day, and look what the graffiti people did to him. Oh! We were going to get him, but I couldn't quite find him. They're too fast for me. Now, what is Is this all the folks in your hometown? This is. This is uh, kind of what we did as a fundraiser back home. We uh, set it up, and we went in and said, hey, if you want to sign it, you can sign it, and uh, hopefully you'll be seen in the Olympics and now on the Tonight Show. Yeah, well, that's great. Good. Now, see, your story is great. It's, 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 it's truly what the Olympics is supposed to be. I know you come from a... A small, your town is, is Afton, right? Afton, Afton Wyoming. Wyoming. And you grew up on? Dairy Farm, uh, had nine brothers and sisters. And, and you're the youngest? I'm the youngest. No, you're the little one. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, uh, the younger ones took all the older ones' uh, food, so the older ones are a little smaller than us. Oh, well, I see how it is. Now, Rulon, what kind of name is that? What is that? Um, where it comes from, there's a lot of uh, people. There's, I heard about five or six people, but Donnie Marie Osmond's uncle is uh, Rulon Osmond. And that's where it came from. Oh, okay. So your friends, with, your folks are friends with them? Yep. Oh, correct. I see. Now your brothers, all their names all begin with R too, right? Yeah. There's uh, <laughs> Roland, Russell, Ronald, Reynolds, and Rulon. <laughs> so, and I got four sisters too: Marcella, Diane, Geraldine, Yvonne. Oh, that's pretty good. That's pretty good. But they, now they didn't, they didn't have the, the one. No, one they were. They had to be different. Now let's see. Get a look at that medal again. Hold that up, so Now this is a great story because I know you are. Look at that. There you go. You can put it on if you want. No, I wouldn't. No, you earned it. I'm the guy. I don't want to put it on. That's, that's yours, man. Because if you now, put it on, I'd have to wrestle you. So. <laughs> now, when did you, when did you get into it? Did this start with your brothers on the farm and all that? Ac actually, it did. It uh, started with them uh, kind of having to, you know, fight and wrestle for our food. So, ended up uh, trying to get whatever we could. So, I saw them wrestle and uh, kind of got interested into it and just picked it up and went to hopefully a different level. and. Got to the college and uh, succeeded there, and next step was the Olympics and either freestyle or Greco, right. and I chose Greco. And now, you weren't expected to win this goal, were you? No, not, not no. even close. Now, this Russian guy, uh, um, Korelin. Alexander Korelin. Now, he had, what, never lost a match since, what, 87? Yep, 1987, 13 years undefeated, never, yeah. given, up, never given up a point in 10 years. Yeah. And it's like a... Because I know I saw Henry Kissinger, I saw uh, Putin, the uh, president Vladimir. of Russia. They were all there. It yep. was like, it, it, it reminded me of when, uh, it was when Hitler was there to watch Jesse Owens get beaten, you know? Yep. I mean, it's true. They all expected, you, you know, thank you very much, go away. And you, I mean, it must have been thrilling to see, <laughs> see their faces. Hey, Jay, uh, you know, uh, Henry Kissinger will be real happy uh, uh, to hear that you compared him to Hitler. <laughs> <laughs> well, you know what I meant, but they were all there. They were, they, it, it was a given, though. It was a given you were going to get second place. Yeah, well, that's not a given that it doesn't take second at least. So yeah. went out, and uh, there's quite a few guys that were uh, good, so we all had to battle, and I got a good draw, yeah. came through and got to the finals, and I would have been pretty happy with second place and went out and decided to go out, work hard, be strong, and never give up and you can be successful. A lot of hometown support for this? Oh yeah, we, yeah. Uh, we had a lot of great support. My, uh, What's the milk can dinner? What was that? <laughs> that was, I never heard of that. Well, what a milk can dinner is, you take a 10 gallon uh, milk can and right. what you do is you take uh, sausage, potatoes, ham, cabbage, uh, carrots, and you put it all in a milk can, put a little water in there, seal it up, and then you put it on the burner or put it in uh, some coals for about a half an hour, let it cook up, and then it simmers for about another half hour, take it out, Good eating. Yeah. <laughs> and that would just be for you, the 10-gallon milk can. Well, we can make one for you, too, if you want. <laughs> <laughs> you 
Yeah, yeah. But now you haven't been home. You haven't been home yet, right? No, we haven't uh, been traveling from uh, Sydney. Actually, we were supposed to be home on the 29th and mm -hmm. ended up uh, being the flag bearer for the closing ceremony. It was, it was a great honor to be American and to represent us and carry the flag in. So did you? Did you? Uh, actually, we got a. We have a tape here of your hometown banner. Here, let's let's take a look. Here, let's put this up here. You can see. Here you go. Right here. There's, there's your hometown. That's right there. Look at, see, there you go. Home of ruling guard. Look at that. That's kind of cool. Yep. That's the world's largest Elkhorn Arch. Oh, so. is that right? Yeah. <laughs> now, good reason to come to Wyoming, right? A few friends of yours have gathered in Afton. I want you to take a look. Here we go. Let's go. Uh, let's go live. There you go. <laughs> you thought you'd get a kick out of that. We got the... Uh, Now this is live right now. <coughs> Got the whole town to turn out. That's your, there's your mom and dad. There's the mayor. That's your coach. That's your high school gym. Yeah, yeah. There you go, there you go. It's all right. <laughs> Now you got me crying. <laughs> that's, that's the governor of the state right there? That's the governor. That's, yeah, yeah, that's the governor. You can all tell the governor guys. They do that all the time. <laughs> you, want, you want to say hello? They can hear you. Oh, great. Oh, man. Hello, Star Valley. Uh, hello, Afton. And uh, love Wyoming. Uh, can't wait to come home and uh, be around friends and family members. Thank you, everybody. And uh, for all the support, Danny Schwab, the whole community of Star Valley, thank you so much. Good job, buddy. Thanks for making us proud. Thank you. Ruling Gardner.